right here render com so today we are going to see how we can render our frame inside blender using the technique of the freestyle so there is a lot of ways i think there is three ways for making our frame i will use the, th the technique and the method of the freestyle first i have added any clay material then i will go to override this material in the scene tab so uh, we w should be in cycles and override this to be the clay after that let's select all all objects and go to edit mode and control e make freestyle edge this is fine and should enable the freestyle from here but i will use samples of 300 maybe and after that let's go for the freestyle here there is a lot of options we will uncheck all of this but let's use the edge mark after that let's go for the stroke and make it square secondly for the thickness i will use two let's test two and the color i will use red let's test this blue also and that's it for the color uh, but we will uh, here in the scene bosses we will add ambient occlusion now we didn't so i have two lights and i will add the camera of course camera will be square dimension and uh, let's snap the camera to be here and we are now done I will move the, the camera to the right place and let's test the light we need more light of course so for the area light let's uh, make it 500 and for this one let's use 10 and I will duplicate the error light we have now uh, done the freestyle options it's just need to be reshaped and let's test another render I will use now 54 test right it has finished rendering and as you can see this is the uh, freestyle and it has been the wireframe has been rendered if you think a uh, two pixel is more than enough you can decrease the thickness from here you can decrease the thickness 1.5 maybe i will choose this and uh, for the thickness 1.5 and uh, let's render another high quality uh, so maybe here 400 and let's render right after a few minutes i think one minute it has finished in the compositing and after that add mix ambient occlusion and this is the result So swap the, this and this is the result of ambient occlusion and as you can see this will take your render to the next level and uh, that's it for this tutorial i hope you like this tutorial so see you in the next lesson